parasites should not be ignored, as they are a great threat to our lives and a cause of many problems. Let's take a look at the top 10 parasites that can damage the brain. Toxoplasma gondii. Toxoplasma gondii is the most famous neurological parasite. More than 2 billion people have Toxoplasma gondii silently present in their brains, giving them no clue as it stays quiet until it attacks. It causes changes in the performance level, reaction time to things, and risky behaviors. Sometimes, it leads to a psychological problem called schizophrenia. Neoglaria floweri. Neoglaria floweri is a dangerous amoeba found in water, which stays as a cyst until it forms into trophozoite upon meeting its host. Trophozoite goes to the brain, where it attaches itself to the brain tissue and gives birth to amoebostome, which starts chewing onto the brain matter. This amoeba multiplies and divides in the brain, taking over the brain completely and starting the symptoms. Mostly, the patients survive for two weeks, in which they start losing their senses, getting confused, having fever, stiffness, and hallucinating before they meet their end. Trypanosoma. Trypanosoma is a parasite carried by the setse fly, which often has an attraction towards the human brain. It disturbs the host's moods, sleeping cycle, and behavior. It makes the host sleep and wake up at odd timings, causing itching, strange talks, depression, leading to coma, and then finally to death. Pork tapeworm, Tinea solium. Tinea solium is also called pork tapeworm, transmitted mostly from pork. Its eggs containing infective larvae travel from the intestine to the blood of the host. They settle themselves in different tissues, especially going towards the central nervous system. It causes neurocystocercosis in the brain, resulting in seizures and other neurological problems. Cryptostrongulus pulmony. Cryptostrongulus pulmony is found in the blood of its host in the form of a microscopic roundworm. It produces molecules that start damaging the brain and its functions. It also affects other organs, which makes it difficult to diagnose it. Spirometra aranaceae europae. Spirometra aranaceae europae is a parasite which does not commonly occur. It has a record of affecting 300 people worldwide in the past half century. Its infection spreads through drinking infected crustaceans containing water, causing headaches, seizures, and memory loss in its host. It also swells the muscles of the eye and appears large nodules under the skin. Paragonimiasis Eating undercooked crab or crayfish can cost you a hard time, as it enters a flat worm with parasitic infection in the host, called paragonemiasis. Traveling through the bloodstream, it makes its way towards the brain, where it infects the tissues and causes headaches, seizures, and strokes. Cerebral Malaria Cerebral malaria enters the body by an infected mosquito, destructing the brain tissues and mostly causing death. Even if someone survives, they suffer from deafness, blindness, seizures, changes in consciousness, and other problems. Echinococcus A tapeworm called hydatidosis, or echinococcus, develops cysts in the brain and spinal cord of its host, damaging the brain and its functions. This parasite is transmitted into the body by eating contaminated food. Helicephalibus gingivalis Helicephalibus gingivalis is a nematode transmitted through contaminated food and skin. It heads towards the central nervous system and then to the blood-brain barrier. It affects people suffering from cancer or HIV AIDS, causing inflammation to their brain, spinal cord, and membranes, leading them to death. Are you aware of any other parasites that can be a threat to humans? Enlighten us with your answers in the comment box below! 
We hope you are learning something new every day from our videos. If you want us to cover a specific topic, let us know in the comment section below or inbox us. We are doing our bit to spread awareness about the common health conditions. Do your part by sharing this video with your friends and social circle.